Alien War, a brand with a lot of hate but also a lot of good reviews. Today I will talk about the R12. There are a lot of models for this PC, so I will talk about the one that's the best in terms of price performance. The 3070 edition. If you are thinking of buying the 1650 version or the 3091, I personally don't recommend it. They are way overpriced and if it doesn't have water cooling, you will eventually have thermal issues. That's what a lot of people have experienced, so that's something to keep in mind if you're going to buy the cheap version. You will have PCs that I recommend you buying instead of those Alien War versions of the R12. You will have them down below in the description of this video. Let's start. In terms of price performance, the Aurora R12 is cheaper than building your own PC. That's how it works nowadays with almost every pair built PC at this moment. And in terms of gaming performance, as we all know it's a beast. A 3070 with the latest i7 is great for even 4K gaming at 60fps average. So if you're doubting because of gaming performance, I don't think it's even a question. Unless you want to stream Flight Simulator at 4K. This one will be more than enough and also, it will run upcoming games, so that's something to keep in mind for the future. But of course, not GTA 6, because as we all know, that game is coming out probably in 20 years from now. In terms of design, you can see that the case is really pretty and clean. And that's something that for me is not important, but I've seen a lot of people that want PCs for their designs. Which I think is kinda crazy, but hey man, I don't blame you, it's okay. One thing I like about this PC is the software where you can customize the lighting. Another positive for this PC is that you can customize things like overclocking really easily and it's upgradable. So if you want to swap components in the future, this is something really good. But of course not everything is good. And there are two things that I don't like about this PC. The first thing is that it's too expensive. It's not overpriced but it's expensive so if you can't afford this PC, remember you will have options for a cheaper price in the description of this video. And the second thing I don't like is that it has a noisy fan. So this PC is not quiet for gaming, but I mean heavy gaming, because if you will play games like Fortnite, CSGO or even GTA 5, it's not going to be too noisy. But if you will play games in 4K at the highest settings, don't expect this PC to be quiet. But keep in mind that this doesn't affect gaming performance as long as thermals are running fine. Before telling you if you should buy this PC, if you're finding helpful information, I encourage you to leave a like so you help this video to blow up. Thank you. In my personal and honest opinion, if you can spend between 23 and 25 hundred, it's worth the buy. I think this pro build is really good overall and will be worth it. But if you want to spend way less or way more, I don't think Alien War is your best option. I really don't. I would only buy Alien War if your budget is between 23 and 25 hundred. Remember that you will have good options down below and you also have a bunch of videos on my channel talking about different type of pre build PCs and PC builds. So, if you need more help before buying a PC, you can check them out and hit the bell button so you get notified when I upload these type of videos that will be helpful for you. Remember that you can ask anything in the comment section and I will reply to all of them. Thank you guys for watching and I will see you on the next one.